So this is a lingually positioned extra tooth that we're going to remove. Um, the patient's actually a little bit older, late 20s, low 30s, so the tooth is pretty solidly in position. Interesting. Hard to see from the films, but the tooth is actually, the root of this tooth is actually kind of between some of the roots of the uh, permanent teeth next to it and right up against them. So careful when elevating. You see my finger a lot of times will go on the, the front part of the teeth, the adjacent teeth, the buccal aspect, just to gauge how much pressure is the elevator is, is giving basically as I go. Some pressure there. So I'm kind of working it from all angles. It's pretty solid. Um, it's not really moving much at all. I'm trying different instruments, elevators. Um, the malt elevator um, actually created a little space, so it, I got the straight elevator in right after that. Still wasn't enough, so now I'm going to break out the periatomes and mallet and just kind of basically like our geology, just kind of tap, 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 create a little space, kind of work my way all the way around the tooth. Um, believe it or not, this is less traumatic than taking a handpiece and getting in there, and because that would require, you know, a bigger incision flap type thing as well. But it's working. So the periotomes come in different shapes and sizes and angles and things. So usually you can find one that can get in the area that you need it to. And you can hear the, uh, as I mallet, you can hear the change in the pitch. Um, indicating that the, the periotome is getting where it needs to be um, between the, the root and the surrounding area. Last little spot, I think, up here. And then I can try to get it out. I'm putting the spade back in now just to give it a last couple of wiggles just to gauge here. how much movement I have, and it looks good. Great. So now I'm ready for the small rangeur to hopefully grab this and just get it out of there. You can still kind of break the, the end of the root off, even just when it's this loose, so I'm just taking my time, because if that happens, it's it's pretty difficult to actually find that. Here it is. 